Howdy y'all, this is Regulus Raven, and welcome back to our adventures here in Omori, where last time we kind of faced off against uh, Aubrey, and uh, that was not, not fun. Um, first we ran around and discovered things in town and in people's houses, that was great. And then we went and found Aubrey in the church and confronted her and she beat us up. She's very strong. And uh, then we went to her house and saw her throwing the um, Basil's photo album in the trash. So we had to go and save that. And then I had to save and quit because Thunderstorm was going on. And literally within the half hour after I stopped, we lost power. So. Very good thing I stopped when I did. Um, even when that episode was over. Anyway, so today we're gonna go and return the um, photo album to Basil and go see what else we can get into today. Um, side note, uh, for my health and stuff, I had to change some things in the settings of my computer. Um, I had to change a blue light filter, and, uh, I'm not certain just yet if it's showing through on the recordings yet or not, so do please let me know if y'all see that. Um, I could check it, I might have to check it, um, in other places just to be sure, but not certain just yet. Anyway, uh... We're gonna go on ahead and dive in here and get to work, get started, go see what else we can go get into. Let's go, um, which button? There we go. Go and, uh, see if we can get in some of these houses. And there we go. This is the house, yeah, this is the house of the girl that wants, um, seashells. We do have that still going. This way? No, it's further down. And... There we go. Knock knock! Puzzle! It's your friends, Kale and Raven! Basil back his photo album. Basil, you didn't tell me you had friends coming over. Would you like to join us for dinner? I always seem to cook just so little too much. Dinner? Sure, sounds delicious. Come on, Raven, for your dinner. Okay, we got food. Make yourself at home. I'll go ahead and finish up with the food. Wow, it's been a while since I've been in here. You definitely have a, have a lot more plants than you used to. Uh, yeah, I like them a lot. Actually, there's some that are still alive from when you guys came here more often. Wow, you sure are dedicated. Yep, that's Basil for you. Flowers and photos. Oh, that reminds me. Now that we got your photo album back, we can all go through the photos together. Uh, that's... Uh, I don't know. It's been a while since you've looked through them, hasn't it? Come on, it'll be fun. My 
first photo. My best friend Raven trying out his new violin. He's starting to take lessons again so he can play at recitals with his sister Murray. So exciting. Just kill being kill. So many party hats. Raven playing a video game on the couch. Raven is a little shy, but he's a really good listener. I always end up venting to him when I get upset or stressed. Sometimes I feel like I'm bothering him, but he never seems to mind. <laughs> We're back from the park, but Kel is still full of energy. We challenge Hero to an arm wrestling match, but we all know who's going to win. Please go with Yoni, my hero. <laughs> Sorry, Kel. Better luck next time. <laughs> Cal was still feeling a little sour about losing to Hero in arm wrestling last night, so Hero decided to lean in for a smooch. Cal looks so annoyed. Ah, brotherly love. Me showing Raven a book I've been reading. Mari stole my camera and took this when I wasn't paying attention. I should really keep better track of my things. <laughs> hmm. It's all of us cuddling with Raven's stuffed animals. He has so many, and they're all so soft. I wish I could just lay here forever. That's cute. Mari is teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Here's Raven and Kel holding Mari's example. It looks perfect, doesn't it? If only Mari thought so too. <laughs> Hero's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting there. You have to admire his his persistence. It's raining super hard today. The rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Aubrey asked me to take a picture of her with her new raincoat. It's her favorite color, pink. Aww. Aubrey won't let Kel under the umbrella, but Kel seems to be taking it just fine. He says he likes how the rain tastes. Kel being Kel again. We went to Hobbies, where the shop owner told Kel to leave his jacket outside since Kel was getting all his comics wet. Sorry, shopkeep. It's been pretty busy with school lately, but we finally made time to get together and go to the park today. Here is Kel hanging by his legs off a tree. He's such a good climber. I wish I was as fearless as him. So the first day of summer vacations, we all wanted to celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon is Aubrey's favorite. Kel cooling off with some refreshing orange joe. I shouldn't get too close or he might get my camera wet. Kel is known to spill his drinks. We buried Raven in the sand. He took forever, but he looks like he's enjoying himself. <laughs> so cute. I wonder if he's going to need help getting out. I guess I'll keep him company until then. <laughs> Yay, Raven is turning 12 today. Even though me, Raven, Aubrey, and Kel are in the same school year, Raven is younger than all of us. He's the baby of the group, so we have to take care of him. That's cute. Raven holding a super huge present from Mari and Hero. Hmm, I wonder what it is. You can't really tell from the photo, but Mari and Hero got Raven a giant building block set. Raven seems much more interested in the box, though. He acts just like Mari's new kitten. Raven won't leave the box, so Kel put a food bowl in inside. <laughs> I guess this box will be Raven and, and Miwo's new home. That's hilarious. We're going beetle catching today. Here's Kel ready to pounce on his next victim. Oh, and Raven is there too. <laughs> he looks kind of sleepy. He looks kind of creepy. I went to the bathroom and came back to this photo. Kel says he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. <laughs> it's the first day of school today. Me, Raven, Kel, and Aubrey are up bright and early. Aubrey is so photogenic. Yes, she is. <sighs> Goodbye, Summer. Until next year. Yeah, 
there's probably supposed to be something there. He's not one to leave big spaces. Especially not like this. Goodness. This entire page is missing. Yes, I'm done looking at the photo album. Oh man! Looks like a lot of the photos are still missing. Maybe Aubrey kept them for herself? We'll have to get those back later. On the bright side, look how short I was. <laughs> I know I've gotten at least a foot. Grown at least a foot since Hero left for college. I can't wait until he comes back. This year I'll finally be the taller brother. <laughs> anyway, don't sweat about the missing photos, Basil. Me and Raven will take care of things for you. You just focus on going back to your happy, carefree self. Okay. Thank you. I'll try. Sorry about the wait. Dinner is taking longer than I thought. Would any of you boys like to help? Yeah, sure, I'll help. I got some experience helping my brother cooking stuff. Oh, that would be lovely. Please follow me. The kitchen is this way. potted plant. Flowers. So pretty. A uh, cactus. Sturdy and resilient. Flowers. A uh, shoe rack. And a dining table. Trash can. Tonight for dinner we'll be making chicken vegetable soup. How's that sound? and veggies. Sounds delicious and delicious. You really think so? I was afraid you'd be a bit disappointed. People always tell me that my taste is a bit bland. Don't worry about what other people think. All food is good to me. I'll eat anything you throw at me. Dinner will be ready soon. Please feel free to make yourself at home. Fridge. Yes, what's in the fridge? Cabbages, carrots, mushrooms, and tofu. See you in here. <laughs> How are you doing, Raven? Is everything okay with you? Mm, okay. Never mind then. Grandma can't hear us, you know? She hasn't been feeling very well lately. It's already been. Four years, hasn't it? It's nice to see that you're still around. Even if it's only for a little while. Here. Take my photo album. I want you to have it. 
I'm trusting you with it, okay? I just think you can probably use it more than me. Basil gave you his photo album. A lot has happened since these pictures were taken. Sometimes it feels like it was all a bad dream. It's hard to remember now, but I think at the time, I took photos of what I was most afraid to lose. Flipping through his album, you can still see the good times. Maybe one day, things can go back to the way they were before. Raven! Battle! Tanner's ready! Okay, coming! I wasn't done exploring. They even have these in the restroom. That's hilarious. A book on plants. Okay. Bathtub with some strange equipment attached to it. It's called handicap equipment. It looks so unenthused. There's one else's toilet. watering can, all the plants, the window, plants, Basil's bed, Basil's camera, it looks really dusty, aww, he's not using his camera? Yes, we're gonna save again. <whistles> Polly and Kel's homemade dinner. Would you like to eat some? Dinner time. Everything tastes so good. You're the best, Polly. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just following Grandma's recipes. Thanks for your help, Kel. Nom, 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 nom. So, as I was saying before, Polly, tomorrow, my other brother here is finally coming back from college. My mom's all crazy right now, preparing the house and everything. No. Don't watch me anywhere near that mess. Although, hmm, I'm pretty excited to see him. Hmm. Every time he comes back, the first thing we do is compare heights. Hmm. This year is the year. Hmm. But I'm, I don't know. Why am I gonna be taller than you? I can feel it in my bones. <laughs> you and your brother seem close. That's good. Family is important. Oh, hey. Hmm. What'd you do with Basil's photo album there, Raven? Uh, oh, I... I gave it to him. I just thought he should have it. Oh, really? Hmm. That's so cool of you. Makes sense. Especially since Raven's moving away and all. What? Raven's... moving? Oh yeah. I thought I already mentioned it. Hmm. I must have forgot. Hmm. He's moving in three days, I think. Hmm. Sorry, I thought you already knew. Oh. Uh... No, I guess I must have missed it. S sorry. Um, may I be excused? I... I have to go to the bathroom. What's up with him? Well, that's just how it is. When you gotta go, you gotta go. Basil's been going to the bathroom a lot lately. I hope it's not my food. Hmm. What's up with him? Mm. Well, that's just how it is. <laughs> you gotta go, you gotta go. I don't think that's it. Sorry I'm saving a lot. I just feel like sometimes you need to. Everything is going to be 
be okay. Everything is going to be okay. Everything is going to be okay. Oh, it's you, Raven. You're here. I'm so glad. You, you can see it too, can't you? Something behind you. Raven, why? Why do you look so scared? Raven, everything's okay now, isn't it? Raven, why? Why do you look so scared? Wait, please, Raven, don't leave me. Not again. Uh oh. Oh, hey, Raven. I think it's about time we're home. It's way past my curfew. So, yeah. Anyway, Polly, if you ever need me, here's my address. Uh, just have a buck. Thanks, Kel, you're sweet. <laughs> oh, it's nothing. Say goodbye to Basil for me. Come on, Kel. Basil! Oh, Basil! Aw, oh, poor guy. He's always had a weak stomach. Hope he feels better soon. probably wondering who I am, right? I'm nobody, really. Just a nurse who's taking care of Basil's grandmother. A few months ago, Basil's parents hired me as Basil's caretaker, since I travel all over the country frequently. I try to do as much as I can for Basil while I'm here, but ever since I've started staying here, I can't shake the feeling that Basil is trying to avoid me. I wonder if I'm doing something wrong. Hmm. She's not doing anything wrong. He's gonna say the same thing. No, Alright, I guess we're leaving. Dang it. Anything up here at night? Besides the cat sleeping on everything? That guy's trash is gone. They're cute. Cats on everything. Goodness gracious. Pretty sure everything here is closed. Ooh, what's this? Water fountain. You can see coins at the bottom. Yes, they're closed. <laughs> There's one vehicle here still. It's got a cat on it. Because of course. Alright, I guess we're going on home. I don't have any choice. Wait, hold up, Evan. Well, it's been a while since you've been over at my place, but now might not be a good time. He's still saying that. Right? 
Which is alright. Hey, Raven. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Sorry for all the trouble. That was a pretty crazy adventure, huh? I can tell you haven't talked to anyone in a while. But that's okay. It just takes practice. Anyway, Carol's coming back from college tomorrow, so I'm sure he'll want to see you before you leave. So, if you don't mind, I'll be coming back for you again in the morning. Good night, Raven. Sweet dreams. Everything covered in bugs. A giant spread web blocks the doorway. In my kitchen knife. I can't walk on that anyway. That makes sense. Whispers emanate from inside the box. Whispers emanate from everything. Hmm. Don't like. Spiders and whispers and everything. And all of the creepiness. We just stepped on a bug. Sounds like camera shutter. And we have to keep moving, right? jump.
not a giant scary spider monster outside. At least everything in here is fine. Maybe. For the most part. Dirty dishes. That we don't feel like doing. There was a shadow out there. Fireplace. There are nails stuck between the bricks. I am even the snow for mommy. If you leave the house, remember to look both ways before crossing the street. Love you. Okay. Not allowed to go in that way either. That wasn't creepy. to do this. I don't think there's gonna be anything there. Very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Yes, please. Welcome to White Space. You have been living here for as long as you can remember. There's a little bit more red on this one. <laughs> There's a stick. Uh, waiting for something to happen. That's a kitten.
A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Open the door. again. Oh, Mori, welcome back. See, hero, I told you not to worry. Oh, Mori always shows up when we need him. Is everything okay, oh, Mori? We were worried about you. Now you're here, let's go out and look for Basil. He's counting on us. Be patient, Kel. We have to make sure that oh, Mori is okay first. Or maybe you and Hero can go yourselves. <laughs> Come on, Omri. Let's go exploring together. Just the two of us. Hey, you can't leave us out of this. He's right, Aubrey. We have to do this together as a team. You never know when you'll need someone's help. We're stronger when we work together. <laughs> Omri and I'll be fine on our own. You'll protect me, won't you, Omori? Ew, gross! Get a room! Come on, Aubrey. It's time to get serious now. Let's go tell Omori that... Omori is okay. You know how she's always worrying about him. Okay, okay, fine. I was just trying to have a little fun. And here we are, right back with everyone else. A photo of someone familiar. Yes, I would like to make toast. <sighs> wow, we have some random stuff in here. It's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. Why does that sound familiar? Going out, Omori? So here's your allowance for today. Some of the clams, nice. Let's go. Hmm. Hi, Mari. Look, Omori is here. Omori. Oh, Aww. Big hug. Stop disappearing like that. You know my heart can't take it. There's still no sign of Basil? Where could he be? We're not sure. I've been looking for him everywhere and still nothing. Hmm. I hope Basil is okay. I miss him so much. Yeah, I miss hearing him talking about all the stuff he didn't do. Like all the flower stuff. And the photo stuff. And the art stuff. And the reading stuff. So tingly. I miss when Basil used to brush my hair. Omori, oh, will you brush it for me? Well, I miss when Basil used to remind me to wash my hands. Look, they're so dirty. Ew, Kel. Kel, you should probably wash your hands anyway. Everyone, I know it's tough right now, but we have to stay positive. We should all try to be like Basil. Even when Basil is upset, he always manages to smile. So, is there anywhere you haven't checked yet? Well, um, there's a forest west of the stone, but... It's gross and full of spiders. Mm. Spiders. Well, you know what that means. Once again, it's time to face you. Time to face your peers, little brother. And that means you too, hero. Come on, big bro. Can't back out now. Just like it is with all morning. We're here to support you all the way. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm just being silly. Don't worry, guys. If anyone or anything tries to hurt you, I'll smash it out of the way. You can count on me. And don't forget about me. I'll always bear there to help you too. 
Yeah. Yeah. We can do this together. Let's go to the forest west of the stump. Lead the way, Omori. That's adorable. We are going to save. And we are going to end things here. Because I meant to be good with this time. But I didn't, so that's the thing. Um, so yes, we are over time again. Because I do this to myself, apparently. Anyway. Um, next time, we will continue looking for Basil in the uh, other world. And see how things go. So... Thank y'all so much for joining me today. If y'all could do, please leave a like. Leave any tips, tricks, suggestions y'all have in the comment section down below. And do please subscribe. I'll see y'all on the next one. Thank y'all. Bye-bye.